It is I, Ngene, keeper of the land. I breathe again. For over 100 years, I have been shot away in a wooden crate. You may as well call it a coffin. I have been buried in the museum store. They think I am dead. Wood, a lifeless object, a sculpture, a piece of tribal art. Little do they know. I am an Alusi, a spirit, one of the family of spirits under our supreme god, Chuku. In the Anambra Valley, in what you call Nigeria, a palace was my home. Each year, before the festival called in my honor, the woman would paint the walls of my compound in red and yellow ochre, as they would paint their bodies with uli. Ah, my brother and sister spirits, Allah, Augu, Amadioha, Ikenga, how I miss them. Where are they now? Have they succumbed to the termites or been burned by those zealots of new religion? In their ignorance, they called us idols. Or have they been taken like me, naked, shipped and sold into the exile of the art market and the anthropological museum? See upon my forehead the noble marks of the Ibuichi. They are shared by gods and mortals. Those mortals at least who are destined to take the Ozo title and who will one day transcend the earthly world to join the ancestors. I am Ngene, keeper of the land. Approach me with respect. Give me cola, pour libation. Make your sacrifices of fowl or goat. I will come to your aid if it is my will. But do not make the mistake of approaching me directly. It is with the Dibia alone I commune. He who marks his eye with chalk, who divines my word and performs the Iba Afa. And you, what would you ask of this exiled God? What would you wish for me? Hmm? Where now is my shrine? 